हेलो गाइज आई एम मंगेश इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी सॉ हाउ टू डिफाइन अल्टरनेट इंडेक्स फॉर विस एम फाइव इन मेन फ्रेम जेसी सो टूडे वी विल सी हाउ वी कैन कॉपी द डेटा सेट फ्रॉम पी एस टू वी सैम सो एक्चुअली दिस प्रोसेस इज कॉल्ड एज लोडिंग द डेटा फ्रॉम पी एस टू वी सैम फाइल ओके सो दिस इज द वी सैम फाइल एंड दिस इज द पी एस फाइल इट इज अ पी एस फाइल ओके डॉट डी एल इज अ पी एस फाइल एंड दिस इज वी सैम फाइल सो दिस टू फाइल शुड बी प्रेजेंट इन योर कैटलॉग मीन्स this vsam file should be already defined in your catalog and this ps file also already present in your catalog it should have some data so you want to copy the data from ps to your vsam file you cannot do it through other process so you have to use idcams utility so idcams is a utility provided in mainframe to copy data from ps to vsam i hope you understand it so we are going to copy it through jcl you can do it manually as well but uh, always uh, it is better to use jcl through code we should copy because we are engineers we are developer right so we should do it through jcl only so this is the job card provided so you can give anything any job card i have already told how to give job card in my previous videos so if you haven't watched those videos please go through the, that video first and then come to this video uh, and this is the step 10 so it you can give anything after that program is go to id comes through id comes we are going to copy that data so ccut in ccut one you have to give input input like uh, from which ps you have to load the data after that in ccut2 you have to give that vsam name in which you have to load that data and note that this two file should be already present i mean this uh, ps file should be already present having some data and that is going to copy in vsam that cluster at least cluster should be there you can define the cluster through that id camps i already taught you how to do that and in ccn you can give repro in file ccut1 and out file ccut2 reuse reuse means if that vsam is there then no need to define every time you can directly uh, reuse in next time to load okay so this is the this is how we can copy the data set or copy the data from data set from ps2 vsam so i hope this video will be helpful for you if you found this video really helpful for you please like share and subscribe the channel and share as much as you can in next videos uh, we will see how we can convert from vsam to ps okay thank you guys thanks for watching